We want to produce an entertaining 90-minute documentary about insects. For this, we need actors and extras. In search of promising talent, we will take you along to the castings. The castings will take place in Switzerland between Lake Neuchâtel on the right, Lake Murten straight ahead, and Lake Beale on the left. Early in the morning, we went to the first casting. Everything is still covered in dew, ideal for creating beautiful macro videos, but bad because we get wet shoes, socks, and pants. Our actors were still asleep or covered in dew. The sun allowed the dew to evaporate and slowly brought the actors up to operating temperature. Insects cannot regulate their own body temperature. Their heart and circulatory system cannot warm them. When they are cold, they have to let the sun warm them. If they get too hot from the sun, they cannot sweat to cool down. We have to wait with our casting until the sun has warmed them to the right body temperature. This cicada doesn't care. It simply sucks behind the dewdrop on the stem. The more hair, the more dew. This fly, the Polenia rudis, has to wait until it is dry. But a pretty picture, isn't it? This grasshopper uses the dew drop as a pillow. This fly has spent the night in the flower. Do you struggle to get out of bed in the morning? Do you think it takes a lot of effort? Take a look at how this male ant has to deal with real problems in the morning. The dewdrop sticks to its butt by adhesion. This is a real fight with the dew. How can a small insect drink when a drop of water is such a problem for them? What must it be like for insects when it really rains? If the surface tension of water is so impenetrable to insects, can they walk on water? Oh dear, now his leg is trapped too. Or this cereal leaf beetle, barely four millimeter long and the dewdrop is almost a third as big. These are real problems, my friend.
Only when these problems have been overcome can a butterfly unfold. Or like hear a little bee getting its breakfast in a flower. It goes without saying that breakfast must be followed by thorough personal hygiene. Unfortunately, today's casting and audition literally fell through. We were on the road too early and we would like to apologize to the actors for arriving too early. We will schedule the next casting date a little later in the morning. So that's it. Until later. Until then.